Welcome to another Spread Cheaters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spread Cheaters website. In this video, we're going to see how to number cells in Google Sheets. Google Sheets has many tools and shortcuts that can be used to automate tasks or to perform tasks that are repetitive. One such tool is the uh, ability to number cells. So when you have, a, where you need to create a series or a sequence of numbers, like for example, in this case where I want to create a list of serial numbers, of course, I can just type the numbers one by one manually. For a small data set, that is fine. But if it is a very large table, then this is not only time consuming, but the uh, probability of uh, error is also very high. So let's see how to use the tools in Google to do this. The first is to use the establish a sequence or a pattern and then use the fill handler. So I just want uh, serial numbers from 1 to 10. So I'll just type the first two numbers of the sequence, select them, then move the pointer until it changes into fill handle and drag this down. And you can see that uh, the numbers are populated automatically. Of course, you need to type at least the first two numbers so that Google knows what the increment is. Now, I'll delete this. And the second one is to use the row function. So this row function uh, takes an argument as, as a cell reference and returns the number of that, um, the row number of that cell reference. If you leave this blank, it will return the number of the row it is in, that is the active cell. In this case, this is actually the second row, but I want serial number one. So I'll select cell A1 instead. And I will get uh, the number one. So when I drag this down, select the cell, drag this down, the formula is copied and I get my numbers in the cells. This is the second way of doing this. The third way, I'll just delete that. The third way is to use the sequence function. The sequence function creates a matrix in which you can specify the number of rows and columns, uh, the number uh, at which the sequence is to start and the increment or the step. So let's see how to do this. I will say sequence and I want 10 rows because there are 10 rows uh, here. I want only a single column because I'm numbering only these cells within this column. I want to start at one and I want the increment to be one and close brackets and say enter. And you can see that this has, the numbers have been automatically populated here. So this could be useful when you have a much larger data set and uh, it would be difficult to maybe drag the fill handle down. You can use this sequence option. This is how to number cells in Google Sheets. Please read the appended article for further guidance.